I'm super excited about today's video because I'm going to show you how to create a QR code that you could use to redirect traffic to your Etsy shop, Instagram, email list, or anywhere else that you would like to promote your business. And what excites me the most about using a QR code is that when you sell an Etsy, the only place that you could add a clickable link is in your about me section. But if your prospective customer doesn't go to that particular section of your shop, it is a lot harder to drive traffic to other destinations like your email list because you can not add a clickable link in your description. However, with a QR code, you could pretty much redirect traffic to any destination. So make sure to stick around to the end because I'm gonna show you how to create them using my favorite graphic design tool, Canva, and how easy they are to incorporate for your small business. Hi, and welcome back. If you're new to the channel, my name is Nancy, and I help small business owners turn their passions into profits. Make sure to subscribe to the channel for weekly videos, and don't forget to hit the notification bell to be the first one notified of any new video. Let's head over to Canva, and I'll show you how to do them. All right, so here we are on Canva, and all you need to do is right here on the navigation bar, go all the way down where it says more, and click on QR code. Here's going to ask you for the URL where you want to drive traffic to. So in this scenario, I'm going to give you three examples of, of different ways that you could drive traffic to. So the first one is my Instagram account. So I'm going to grab the URL of my Instagram and I'm going to place it right here where it says enter URL, generate code. And here is my code. So what's nice about this is that if I wanted to promote my Instagram account, I could essentially do this by having people scan this code and it will redirect them to my Instagram. I could use this as a listing on my, as a photo of one of my listings in my Etsy shop. I could use this on any, anywhere that I could add an actual photo like Facebook. I could use it on LinkedIn. I could use it on Reddit. I could use it on any forum where I want to promote my Instagram account. Another cool way to use a QR code is to grow your email list. So essentially it's the same thing. You would grab the URL where you want people to go to sign up for your lead offer or your lead magnet offer like this one here that I have. Or maybe you have like an incentive. If you if they join your email list, they get 10% off, right? Um, on their first purchase on XE. So you would grab the URL. You would essentially do the same thing into the new URL, generate code, and here is your new code. So this is the code that people will scan in order to download my free lead magnet or your discount in this situation. Keep in mind, you could color the background. You could change the color of the background. You could use your branding colors. You could add your URL. You could add your logo. You could add your fonts. So it's cohesive with your brand. And another great way to use a QR code is to go ahead and promote your Etsy store. And the same thing, you would just go to your Etsy store. Here's my smaller store that I use for tutorials. And from here, you would just go to, again, more. You would click on QR code. You will delete the previous URL, add your the new URL, generate code, and here is the code for my Etsy store. So now when people scan this code, it will take them directly to my Etsy store. And these are really great ways to grow your business. And a lot of people love QR codes. Many people also use them for their thank you card. So in the thank you card on the bottom right corner, they might add a QR code that says, click here to visit our Etsy store or click here and let's be friend on Instagram, right? So you could cross promote when you're promoting to your buyers. Um, you could tell them, hey, follow us on Facebook and you could have a QR code in your actual thank you card that you give them when they purchase from you. But just wanted to show you different ways that you could use a QR code, not only to gain new followers, but also to grow your email list, which is super, super important. And I know that XE makes it a little bit hard to grow the email list because the only place they allow clickable links is in the about me section so this will make it a lot easier for you to add one of these on every single listing you have in your store have a system in place 
where people automatically will see it and whether you know they decide to join or not at least you have a higher chance of conver converting more people into actual leads i hope that this tutorial helped you if you have any questions i am an open book so let me know be below and if you enjoyed this video don't forget not only to like it but let me know in the comments what you enjoyed about it and if you plan to use qr codes thanks for watching and i'll see you on the next video